Hi guys, in today's video I will be walking you through the process of changing terminal cursor settings in Visual Studio Code. So let's get to it. Okay, so like I mentioned in this video, we will be going through the process of updating cursor style settings in Visual Studio Code. So here I am in my Visual Studio Code and uh, what I need to do is go to terminal and I'm going to open a new terminal and as you can see here um, I have my terminal and the cursor currently is coming in as a block okay so you can see and this is what I'm talking about this block here so what I want to do is I want to change this block to a vertical bar instead all right so how do I how do I do that so to do that um, all you have to do is right here in your terminal go to this uh, section uh, further right here and uh, click this uh, arrow that is pointing down so this will bring up these options here and uh, the one that you want to select is this one for configure terminal settings so if you click that uh, you will uh, see this window now where you can customize your, 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 your settings so what i want to do is i want to scroll down uh and the option that we're looking for is for casa settings if we can see it okay so i'm going to scroll down slowly and let's see if we can see that option okay so right here okay so it it uh, it is right here in terminal interpreted and cursor style so the, the 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 style that we currently have is block and i want to change this to a line okay vertical line uh, you can also change it to underline if that's what you like but for me i like this one for line so i'm going to click that and uh once you do that you can see that now your uh, cursor style changes okay so now it changes from block to a line okay so and if we go back to that setting uh which is right here right here okay terminal uh integrated cursor style so again it was block at the beginning and now i've changed it to line uh you can also go to underscore and you can see it updated it in real time to underscore or underline really uh so yeah this is uh this is where you go if you want to change your your cursor style settings i think uh, for me i'm just going to leave it in um uh, as a line and uh i think there are there are some other options that you can you can choose uh for your cursor uh style okay so i'm just going again to make this one as a line um what else do we have here yeah there are uh, several other options i'm not going to touch any of this but um yeah that's what i just wanted to show you guys how to change your cursor style setting uh it took me some time to figure this out before but you know i thought this might be help helpful for you if you are looking for uh, uh the process of changing this cursor style settings in your vs code okay so i hope that was helpful if you have not subscribed to the channel please do subscribe so that you can stay updated uh uh, for our upcoming videos all right guys thank you very much and uh, have a good day bye bye